What we do know for sure is when North Texas schools reopen for in-person learning, the classrooms are definitely going to have a new look to them pretty much everywhere. Today, CBS 11 gets an exclusive first-hand glimpse into a Garland ISD school, and our Brooke Rogers takes us all inside. Here at Stevens Elementary School, the walls are still bare. The teachers have yet to put their finishing touches on the classrooms. But much of what you see here is the way it will look, with desks set up for safety and social distancing. They can still see their friends. They can still interact with their friends. Um, they just have to do it from a little bit of a distance. 15 desks can fit into this fourth grade classroom, six feet of separation between each one. Three way plastic barriers surround not just the teacher's desk, but each student's. It's really more to protect the students and the teachers as they're up there teaching. A teacher can't simply sit behind the desk and be effective, so she is going to have to walk around, so this will aid on that. This is one of Garland ISD's model classrooms for the new school year, the result of brainstorming and purchasing in a quickly changing landscape. Officials say most of the funding came from the CARES Act. The district also approved hiring an additional custodial employee for each school. Every day, they will do nothing but wipe down high touch point areas. So, for instance, they'll clean the shields, they'll clean doorknobs, countertops. They'll do it four times a day, every two hours. And after school each day as well. The hallways also have new additions, direction arrows, and social distance markings. And every student must wear a face covering and will be provided with a mask and a face shield. The goal, officials say, is to make the classroom feel as normal as possible during a time that is anything but. What we want to do is provide a warm and inviting environment for them. Brooke Rogers, CBS 11 News.